Hey there, welcome back to East Texas Live on KETK. Joel Yates with the Alzheimer's Association is back in studio to talk about another big walk to end Alzheimer's. Uh, there was one in Longview last weekend. Now it's time for get, to get ready for the walk in Tyler, which is not this weekend, but next weekend. Right, on the okay. 28th. Yep. All right, so it's coming up Saturday, October 28th. Starts at UT Tyler. We know this walk is a fundraising event. What are y'all using the funds for? Yeah, so we use the funds for research, of course, and then also for care and support for people in the community. And we're real excited about some of the, the things that are coming down the line as far as the research. Some new treatments have come out this year that we're really excited about. That's what I like hearing about. I like yeah. that's so hopeful <laughs> hearing there's finally new treatments coming out because it's been one of these things like buck up and we'll get there eventually one day. And we're, it seems like we're sort of turning a corner with this. We finally, feel, I feel like we are. We finally are able to, we have some treatments removing plaques from the brain. Um, from those amyloid plaques that are causing the dementia and so helping uh, slow the progress of the disease. We're not to a cure yet, but these are pro very promising. All right, so tell us uh, what they can expect if they go to the, the walk at UT Tyler. What's going to be on site? Yeah, so we're super excited to have UT uh, nursing students coming out to help and they are sponsoring a kids zone with games out on the lawn. It's going to be a lot of fun. We have a senior hangout tent for those that want to participate and be involved but can't actually do the walk and so they can hang out in that tent and then of course we have a long and a short route on the walk as well. So are you guys accepting volunteers either for the walk or just what y'all do the other, you know, 300 <laughs> something days a year? <laughs> yes, we, we do. We are a very volunteer run organization and so we need volunteers on walk day to help us set up and tear down and man some of the stations, water station, things like that. And then, of course, we need volunteers to help with, with care and support in the community and education and things like that. All right, if the lady watching wants to go to the walk on Saturday, next Saturday, what time does she have to be at UT Tyler? Yeah, so we have a vendor fair at 8 o'clock where you can come and play the games and, and meet our vendors and our sponsors. And you can do that at 8. We have an opening ceremony at 9 o'clock. Uh, and then we'll kick off the walk right after that. All right, well, that's not too bad. So uh, let's get it right this time where you can go for more information. ACT.ALZ.org slash Tyler. ACT.ALZ.org slash Tyler. Speaking of Tyler, how did he do MC in your event last week? He did a great job. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of fun, yeah. He's a fun guy, isn't he? <laughs> he is. All right. Yes. Well, I I'm glad to hear for the, the good result from Longview. I hope we get a bigger one from Tyler. Yeah, me too. Thank great you. cause. Thank you, Joel. Thank